President Uhuru Kenyatta has been very key in empowering the woman. Na alifahamu ya kwamba kina mama walihitaji tu nafasi kidogo na wataweza kujiendeleza. Upo ule mfumo ambao ulikuwa umeanzishwa na Rais Mwai Kibaki uliofahamika kama Women Enterprise Fund. Na Rais Uhuru Kenyatta aliweza kuendeleza mfumo huu ili kuweza kusaidia kina mama zaidi kupitia sasa takriban bilioni 19.5 zimeweza kutolewa kupitia mfumo huu wote ili kuweza kusaidia kina mama katika maeneo mbalimbali. Naye Rais Uhuru Kenyatta akaja akaanzisha Uwezo Fund. Uwezo Fund nayo pia imeweza kubadilisha maisha ya kina mama pale mashinani kwa kuwapa nafasi ya kuweza kupata mkopo aidha kwa kibinafsi ama kwenye grupu zao mbalimbali pale nyumbani. Fund yenyewe kufikia sasa imeweza kugawanya shilingi bilioni 6.9 kwa kina mama kila mahali. Baada ya kuhakikisha ya kwamba kina mama wamepata mtaji yapo masuala mengine ambayo yameweza kumkwaza mwanamke. What we are talking about is gender based violence and other than that there is also what you call the female genital mutilation. These two things are things that his excellency took to heart and therefore he challenged the various organizations both private and public to come up with institutions and to come up with policies that would be able to protect the woman against female genital mutilation as well as gender based violence. Through his efforts that he has been able to do through the private sector as well as religious organizations and as well as the government itself kuliweza kupata mafanikio makubwa mnamo mwaka 2019 ambapo viongozi wa kijamii what you call the cultural leaders as well as religious leaders waliweza kuja kwa pamoja na kuweza kutia sahihi mkataba which was going to see the ending of female genital mutilation ni kupitia swala hili zima la kuweza kuleta pamoja baadhi ya viongozi wa kidini na baadhi ya viongozi wa kijamii is when we got what we call the Kisima Declaration in 2021 that involved the Samburu elders because they came together they agreed and they say that they would champion the ending of female genital mutilation a great win for his excellency president Uhuru Kenyatta ni mengi kweli ambayo ameweza kufanywa ilikuona ya kwamba wasichana pia hawapitii ukeketaji huo and what has been done is to ensure that right from the chief level all the way to the national government that various centers have been placed including the police to be able to have lines and centers where the young girls can be able to run to and report any kind of female genital mutilation happening or any kind of gender based violence these are various centers and offices that have been built in the various chief centers as well as police stations locally to help the girl to help the woman find justice mbali na hayo ni kwamba utafahamu ya kwamba wanawake mara nyingi na mara kwa mara walikuwa wanapata shida kubwa sana wakati wanapokwenda kujifungua swala so, hili lilikuwa la maana sana hata kwa mama wa taifa and that is when she began the beyond zero initiative this initiative has helped to bring down the mortality rate by a very big percentage zaidi ya yote imehakikisha ya kwamba kina mama wamepata sehemu za kwenda kujifungulia kwa wingi very many centers have been established to enable the woman find an opportunity or a place to be able to give birth in a protected private secure and healthy place other than that ipo linda mama ambayo imeweza kuwekwa mkakati ambao unawezesha kina mama kuweza kujifungua katika vituo vya afya bila malipo kwa kweli kina mama kilio chetu kimeweza kusikika na Rais Uhuru Kenyatta naye yuko mbioni pamoja na mama wa taifa Margaret Kenyatta kuhakikisha ya kwamba wewe mama umepata nafasi yako katika jamii. Hongera Rais. <tune>